it's Dr. Dusty here. So I'm going to share a little story with you in regards to my shoulder. Um, I've done some videos on chiropractic care in your shoulder, so I'm going to share a video with you regarding my shoulder. So back in 89, I was going to Illinois State University to get my prerequisites to go to Palmer College of Chiropractic. So anyhow, I was in my garage and I was riding, uh, my, I was on my bike and I did a tight turn to turn out of the garage so I could go for a bicycle ride. And uh, in the process of turning, I actually fell and uh, my bike and I went over like that, right on the side and fell onto my shoulder, whiplashed my head and really hurt, but I got up and kind of brushed myself off, got back on my bicycle, went for my ride. The next day I woke up and my shoulder was just inflamed and sore. The pain was very, very deep. And I thought, oh, for sure I'd broken my arm. So I decided, well, I'm gonna to go to the Illinois State University Clinic and uh, get checked out by the medical doctor there. And uh, I requested an x-ray. And so they took an x-ray and came back and said, well, Dustin, uh, your shoulder is not broken. Your arm's not broken. I thought, oh my God, well, what could this be? And so I believe they prescribed some, you know, painkillers or ibuprofen or something like that. So a few days went by, the pain got worse. The pain was really deep. It actually had started to wrap around my arm. I went back to the clinic, had another set of x-rays taken. Sorry, Dustin, no broken bones. And so I was really at that time not knowing what to do. And so finally, I had a short break a few days later. And so I went to my chiropractor in Henry, Illinois, where, where I grew up, Dr. David Forbes. And um, he got me on the table and did an exam. And he said, well, geez, you've got a, a you pinched nerve in your neck. You feel the tension in there and the soreness. And, and it was like way painful in my neck. But I didn't even know that. It was because the pain was so bad here in my shoulder. So Dr. Forbes uh, did some therapy on me and then he adjusted me. And within a couple, three or four adjustments, my pain started to diminish significantly. And of course I continued to get some care with him um, over the years after that too. And, um, but anyhow, I wanted to just let you know that the moral of the story here is just because your pain is in your shoulder and maybe you've got some of these conditions here, really the bottom line is that if you've got a pinched nerve in the C5, C6 area of your vertebrae, of your neck, these things that you could have, like a diagnosis of a frozen shoulder or some rotator cuff muscle tears. Um, now these tears, of course, you can get a tear, but it really could be caused by a pinched nerve in your neck that is not getting the right amount of nerve supply into those muscles that creates a situation where your rotator cuff muscles get torn or it can create a situation where you get a frozen shoulder or it creates a situation where you get bursitis or tendonitis. So the bottom line here is make sure that you get your your neck evaluated by a chiropractor to look at this to see if that might be causing all of this all right so my contact data is below if you know somebody that has some shoulder problems make sure they get to their chiropractor and get checked out or make sure they get into me and get checked out and uh, i look forward to seeing you in the office okay so dr dusty here there's my story on my shoulder i look forward to seeing you in the office get your shoulder fixed and in better shape so that you can live a pain-free life. See you later.